Happy quarantine weekend, everybody. Coming at you from Tennessee, lockdown, bringing you all the latest COVID updates. There's no change. It's the same disastrous situation um, as last weekend. But I do hope everybody's making do and staying safe for their Easter weekend. I hope we all make the best of it. Things are still super surreal here. Like I mentioned last weekend, it's just, it's very strange. I went down to Publix earlier, mask on and everything. And again, it's so strange seeing the employees, the, the people coming in and out, um, having to go in slowly because they're wiping down all of the carts. I didn't need one, but you still have to wait in the queue. Um, not really a queue, but anyway, um, it's just, it's very strange. And they've got, you know, lines where you can only go certain ways down the aisles and of course staying six feet apart. And you're hearing over the intercom, um, not just at Publix, but when I stop to get a drink in the morning for work, you'll hear these um, PSAs of remember to stay six feet apart. And it is something like in a movie. It is the strangest thing. And I, I would have never expected this. I think I said that last weekend to be in a situation like this. It's really like in a movie. It's scary. And it's just gotten worse and worse and worse. All these precautions and to hear it playing over uh, loudspeakers, radios, just all these PS, it's like war times, I, some post-apocalyptic video game. I, it's, it's very surreal is the only word I can think of, but hopefully this can all blow over soon and get rid of this whole COVID nonsense and then start to rebuild our now shattered economy and all of the fallout with businesses and such. Everybody's being laid off, hours being cut down. My hours have been cut down. Yay, apocalypse. So there's that. My cat's making noise for my Amazon Prime delivery because I didn't want to go out to the store to get conditioner. So they just sent me some via Amazon Prime. Yes, it's suave. <laughs> I like suave, I don't care. I didn't want to go down to the store and get it. Um, some positive updates, though, not a, not really an update, but a positive observation is seeing, like right now out the window, I'm seeing all of these people out walking around. I was at my sister's neighborhood just earlier, and I mean, just everybody is out on the streets, not congregating, but you're seeing families out walking around. They're not sitting at home in front of their computer watching Netflix or playing video games. You're seeing kids out riding bikes, so they're getting exercise, they're getting fresh air. So that's just a nice observation to see that we are going outside and we are enjoying the day and enjoying each other and being home and now that we have a choice. I mean, <laughs> I have to enjoy these people's company. I don't have anybody. But it is really nice to see that we're getting exercise and getting out and that people aren't going out as much. So that is really good that we are taking this seriously and we're doing the most and the best we can, the best effort to avoid going out and continuing the spread. So just everybody, please be safe. Minimize your travels. I've barely gone out. I went to the store to my sisters. That's about it for today. So everybody enjoy your lockdown weekend and have a wonderful Easter.